friends, today I'm going to read from caterpillar to butterfly. Let's find out what happens. Today a caterpillar came to school in a jar. It is eating green leaves. It is climbing and wiggling. The tiny caterpillar is going to change. It will change into a beautiful butterfly. Sorry, friends, a page doesn't want to turn. Caterpillars usually turn into butterflies outdoors. They live in gardens and meadows and yards. But we will watch our caterpillar change into a butterfly right here in our classroom. The change is called metamorphosis. Our caterpillar started out as a tiny egg. The mother butterfly laid the egg on a leaf. When the caterpillar hatched out of the egg, it was hungry. It ate its way out of its own eggshell. Then it started to eat green plants right away. Each day when we come into school, we look at our caterpillar. Each day, it is bigger. Maybe you can go outside and see if you can find a caterpillar. Our skin, our skin grows with us, but a caterpillar's skin does not grow. When the caterpillar gets too big for its skin, the skin splits down the back. The caterpillar crawls right out of its own skin. It has new skin underneath. This is called molting. Our caterpillar will molt four or five times. Can you think of something else that molts? Hmm. After many days, our caterpillar is finished growing. It is much bigger than when it came, first came to school. It is almost as big as my little finger. There he is. Our caterpillar is making a special house. First, it makes a button of silk. It uses this button to hang upside down from a twig. Then it molts for the last time. Instead of new skin, this time there is a hard shell. This shell is called a chrysalis. Our caterpillar will stay inside the chrysalis for a long time. So here's the caterpillar in the jar. And over on this page, here's the button of silk. And then here's the chrysalis starting. Every day, the chrysalis looks the same. We can't see anything happening, but inside the chrysalis, our caterpillar is changing. Will our caterpillar ever turn into a butterfly? Will it ever come out of its chrysalis? We can hardly wait, but we do. We wait and we wait and we wait. They're doing their schoolwork. Oh my goodness, this book does not want to turn the page. There we go. Then one day during snack time, somebody shouts, look, and we all rush over to see. The chrysalis is cracking. We see a head, a body, and then wings. It's a butterfly. See how he's coming out? The tiny caterpillar who came to school in a jar turned into a painted lady butterfly, and we saw it happen. Our butterfly is damp and crumpled. It hangs on to the chrysalis while its wings flap, flap, flap. Blood pumps into its wings. The wings straighten out and dry. Soon, our butterfly will be ready to fly. Our butterfly cannot stay in the jar. It needs to be outside with flowers and grass and trees and other butterflies. 
It is a warm spring day. I put my finger into the jar. The butterfly sits on my finger. I will pull it out and our butterfly goes free. We feel a little sad and a little happy. Thanks for listening. Hope you enjoyed it.